welcome back to part 5 of my Skyrim Let's Play. Today, I'm... I think we're going to continue with the main story, I think. Uh, I don't know. Actually, we'll go repair our... Uh, do up our armor and everything. So, get better weapons or upgrade our weapons. We'll walk around and see if anybody has quests for us that they want to do or stuff like that. And then, I think what I'm gonna do with these episodes is if there's a way to walk, I'm gonna just skip to that area and then. Ah, uh, not you guys. No. Just no. You there. You're the one they call Dragonborn. Yes. Then it is too late. The lie has already taken root in the hearts of men. So we shall expose to them the falseness in their hearts by tearing out yours, deceiver. When Lord Mirak appears, all shall bear witness. None shall stand to oppose him. Find them. Time to die. Good. Of course I have that out. <laughs> it's it's kind of silly how you can just pause mid uh mid fight, but I like it. I, I like it. I played this game so many times. Nope. Nope. <laughs> Go there. Maces. Swords. No. War axes. Okay, so dual fury. Let's do this one. Bye. God might get nervous. A man approaches oh, with his weapons. Fucking drawn. shut up, you just had a fight, didn't you see? You guys can clear out the bodies. Cultist orders taken. Read the orders. Well, oh, actually, I want to eat the troll fat. Eat. Is that so much to ask? Board the vessel North Maiden, dock with Raven Rock, take in to Wilhelm, then begin your search, kill the false dragonborn known as Garrus before he reaches Solvenstein. Return with word of your success and I shall be most pleased. It's night time as well, so the fucking... How do I wait? Time, I'm guessing that stands for. Yes. You know, just stand here for eight hours. You 
Alright. Alright, let's see what they have for sale if we need anything in particular. Welcome to War Maidens. Now don't let the name worry you. We got plenty of steel for fighting men. We've got small weapons. Looking to protect yourself or deal, deal some, some damage? damage. Thirty-four iron. Damn. I wish I could have that. Steel arm. Okay, let's see if I can sell it. <laughs> Fucking double clicks, man. Pay fucking 765 to get my armor back that I wasn't meant to sell you. Screw that. Fucking. I'll find another piece Good of armor. Good doing business with you. You're gonna turn around, buddy. No, you're just gonna sit there. Yeah, I know, you follow me wherever I go. Another chess piece. Oh. Hello. What's your Gonna name? get cold tonight. Might want to at least cover your delicates. Oh, what happened? Got some good pieces out. I don't claim to be the best blacksmith in white. Yes, actually. How about you smith me an iron dagger? Here's everything you need to make one. Go ahead. Hmm, blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. Don't forget to check inside the shop if you need anything. Right, I am last minute to sign dagger first, so. That's a decent weapon you need then.
<laughs> Let's try not to sell it next time. Have you met my father? Not bad, but it's a little dull. How about you sharpen it up? Just need a bit of metal and the grindstone over there. All right, then. Got some good pieces out. I don't claim to be the best. This looks good. You put time into your blades, they'll serve you well when you need them. You want to keep helping? How about you make some armor? Let's start by tanning some leather on the rack. Don't forget to check inside the shop if you need anything. I help my father. You think all the council, my father? Ah, good. A lot of weapons and armor need leather for straps fitting. That kind of thing. Let's see if you can make a hide helmet. Here's the rest of what you need. Until next time. Have you met my father? Oh, shit. I should hire you to be my assistant at this rate. Please. Let's improve the fit. Take this leather to the workbench over there. All right then. This is a mod that I've installed as well. It puts to with Got some good pieces out here if you're looking to buy. More back. inside. I don't claim to be the best blacksmith in White Run. Bjorland Graham. Got that on me. Man's steel is legendary. All I ask is a fair chance. I'm waiting. You have talent. Keep working at your craft and you'll be a fine smith one day. Why don't you keep that dagger and helmet? Maybe you will remember me when you're making Skyforge steel, huh? I, that I do. I've got to, if I hope to be as good as Yorland Greymane someday. In fact, I just finished my best piece of work. It's a sword. I made it for the Jarl, Balgroof the Greater. It's a surprise. I don't even know if he'll accept it, but... Listen, could you take the sword to my father, Preventus Avenici? He's the Jarl steward. He'll know the right time to present it to him. Thanks. The finest weapons and armor. The finest weapons and armor. You don't claim to be the best, but the finest weapons and armor. If you can have that helmet, you can have the iron dagger. If you can have the leather. I'm running out of arrows. Probably Don't forget to check inside us. the shop if you need anything. Well met, Traveler. What brings you to Whiterun? Ah, so it's gold you're after then. You need only ask about it. Plenty of folk in White Run with too much fat and gold to be bothered doing anything for themselves. Aye, that I do. Half all my life. We Battleborns have been here since the beginning, along with the Grey Manes. Our family's been closest kin for generations, but Ulfric Stormcloak's uprising has divided us. 
Now, seems we can scarce look at each other without coming to blows. Petty and foolish, that. They are saying dragons have returned to Skyrim. Now that there, that's a real problem. Ain't sure if they're taking on new members, but you should talk to the companions. They're over in their hall. You're a basker. If by work, you mean testing your steel in bloody battle. May your sword be sharp, and your tongue sharper. I spend a lot of time. Once I've made enough money trading with the Khajiit caravans, I'm going to buy the bannered mare from Hulda. Before my Ma and Da passed, I told them that one day, I'd become the best trader in Skyrim. I met one of the caravan leaders, Madron. He said he'd help me get started if I could bring him a mammoth's tusk. Easier said than done. You'd do that? If you find one, I could teach you a thing or two about trading. Help you get a fair bargain in the future? <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna sneeze. Yeah, these Khajiit make a living traveling the roads and selling their wares. It's got to be tough. Skyrim's a hard enough land when you've got a roof over your head. Oh. Worst thing is, nobody wants them in the cities. Yeah. Nobody trusts them. Reputation mostly. A lot of Khajiit turn to smuggling and thievery to get by. A few bad apples spoil the bunch. You know how it is. About the same as everyone else. They're the cat folk of elsewhere. Great warriors, good traders. Way I hear it, elsewhere ain't nothing like Skyrim. It's got tropical forests and dusty badlands. It sounds awful. Farewell. Bitch, get out of here. Bits and baubles for sale, all crafted by the best blacksmith in Skyrim. Some may call this junk, me, I call them treasures. You take care of yourself now. Disguise, traveler. I'm the commander of the guard here in White. Seems our enemy, Balgruff and I, share a battle bond. We met as youths and forged our friendship in the fires of war. When he became Jarl, I insisted on serving as his protector. He had no cause to argue. Gods, you are curious. Almost dangerously so. I am charged with protecting the Jarl from any and all threats. Powerful men have many enemies, more so in times of strife, so you can imagine the dangers. Oh yes, there have been attempts on the Jarl's life. More than one would-be assassin has met his end at the tip of my blade. I am charged Badness, with protecting sir. the Jarl from any and all threats. May the gods watch over your battles, friend. No doubt, he thought it was the only way to make his point. And also, because he knew he could. 
If it's the war you're referring to, I'm on the side of Whiterun. No doubt General Tullius and his friends in the Empire will tell you that I owe them my loyalty. And perhaps I do. Ulfric Stormcloak would say that I owe my allegiance to the Nord people as they fight for Skyrim's independence. Perhaps this is also true. The day might come when I am forced to draw my sword for one side or the other. But that day has not come yet. With good planning and constant vigilance. Even now, my court wizard, Ferengar, continues his research into ways we might drive back these terrors. We must also have ample reserves of water to combat the fires that will surely spread after an attack. But our greatest weapon? Courage. For if we cannot kill the beast, we must at least have the tenacity to drive it back. Until brave heroes step forward to destroy these monsters, that is the best we can do. You mean brave I've heroes? Got to go to to I've got a city to keep. Now where is the people I need to speak to? Come to Dragon's Reach. It seems this damnable conflict has claimed everyone's passions of late. Me, I prefer my books and my spells. Sadly, no. My work affords me few opportunities for such an adventure. Perhaps some hero will bring one to Dragon's Reach, like old Olaf one I once did. What a fascinating conversation that would be. If I said that was a tedious question, would you be smart enough to know what I meant? Probably not. As long as I'm left alone to pursue my research, I don't care who gives the orders. Now, I'm a busy man, and your pointless questions are boring me terribly. Good day. There's a tranquility in magic, don't you think? It is simply energy to be harnessed by those with the... I believe I am, yes. Technically speaking, of course. The city is also home to a priest, priestess, an alchemist, and I'm sure others who practice. Ah, that reminds me. Speaking of alchemists, I have some frost salts for Arcadia. She asked me to obtain them for one of her potions. Would you be so kind as to deliver the frost salts for me? I'm sure Arcadia will provide some form of recompense. Good. You're clearly better suited than I am to carry out such a menial task. You know, if you've got the aptitude, you should join the Mages College in winter. See, I just want to steal shit from you. Another wanderer, here to lick my father's boots. Good job. See, there's meant to be a dude around here. I'm gonna give this sword to. I can't find him. Maybe if I actually put a quest on. probably won't make too many of these episodes that are off topic but I feel like it, I had to do something else to level up a little bit and get some money so I can do other things I serve Jarl Balgruff from Adrian? Ah, 
This must be that weapon for the Jarl. Poor girl. So eager to prove herself. I'll present it to Balgruff when his mood is agreeable. Thank you. Please, take these few coins for services rendered. Five hundred thousand. What? No. I'll build my own house. Enjoy your visit to Dragon's Reach. I'm not. I'm a delivery man at this point, but it's just. <laughs> I thought I could find a quest that was actually quite close by that wasn't a delivery quest, but I was wrong. And I also don't want to take Lydia on missions because I don't want her to die. I want to keep everybody alive. The only one I want to take on missions with me is ah uh, fucking. The woman vampire, the one that can't die. What is it? How goes the begging day, Brenny? Patron of the That's great clan, not the town beggar like every one of us. But I've got a right to browse, don't I? I ain't hurt anyone. Make it quick, then. I want your stink driving my customers. I away. ain't done. From the wilds. Oh, thank you. Divines bless your kind heart. Sure, whatever. For God's well, it's hard enough with all these men propositioning me. But that, that bard is the worst. That bard Mikhail is begging for a dagger up against his throat, the way he goes on about me. I heard him boasting at the Bannered Mare, saying he'll conquer me as a true Nord conquers any harsh beast. <laughs> I'm cooking a special breakfast for a friend, and they're his favorite. Would you want to try? Go right ahead. I don't think anything will get through that thick skull of his, though. Best you forget whatever you think you saw, Ed. Such idle talk. Remember, fresh food and vegetables every day. Take a good look around. I'm sure you'll find what you're looking for. If yeah, not, all those health know. potions that say steal. You look rather pale. Could be a taxia. It's quite a problem back home in Cyrodiil. Ah, splendid, splendid. It's for a special brew I'm working on. A love elixir like none other. Maybe I'll test it on Faringar first. Oh, but I suppose you expect some compensation. Um, here. These potions should suffice. long as you clean up. You know how to use it, right? Mix a couple of ingredients together, see what happens. A little wheat and blister wart makes a healing potion, if you didn't know. We have plenty of ingredients for sale, too. Of a sort. I don't have formal training in the restoration school, but... something just as good. Within these walls, I have all that I need to brew a potion for nearly any ailment. If I had a septum for every case of rock joint or whitbane I've cured since I opened this shop, I'd be a rich woman indeed. Come back any time if you need a remedy. What do you need, my friend? You look rather pale. Could be ataxia. 
It's quite a problem back home in Cyrodiil. Pardon me, but do I detect a case of the rattles? I've got something for that. I, I need, I'm gonna quickly check my thing because she won't shut up. Active effects. Why is she moaning? I don't have any bad effects on me. Where's your alchemy lab? That's right there. No. Oh. If there's anything I can help you with, you have but to ask. You brewed a truly vile poison there. I pity the beast that tastes. Find tonics, salves, pills, and potions on my shelves. Browse to your heart's content. Well, I just made a bunch of random potions. <laughs> See, I need all the healing potions I can get. I sell cures for all ills, and I'll be happy to serve you. So many more healing potions, and I really want to steal them. Whoa! She was quick. What of my son? Hmm? What of Thorold? Is he nothing? So go. Come on in. Just stoke the fire. This is a local a favorite and one out. of the first songs I ever learned. Rap. If it's a lady, you look. Carlotta put you up to this, didn't she? I'm sorry, but that fiery widow is mine. She just doesn't know it yet. Oh, hey there. I didn't mean to make you upset. On my honor, Carlotta won't have to worry about me again. Some parting advice? Women love sonnets. If it's work you need, how about chopping up some wood for the fires? I enjoy this work well enough, but I'm ready to retire. I've been thinking of selling the inn to Isolda. Anyway, what do you need? Have you seen that shrine of Asura? They say the Dark Elves built it after they fled from Morrowind. Sight to see. Need anything else? Just let me know. Need something? Yes. Oh, Sadia. Yes, Mum. Just a reminder, sweetie. This the is blankets an ode still to need to be washed. Staunch protectors. The of course, Mum. We drink to our youth. What do you need, the handsome? Days come and gone. For the age of aggression is just about. Are you gone. sure? Oh no. They found me. I need your help, your please. Come with me. I need to speak to you privately. Take back our home. Quickly, come with me. Down with Ulfric, 
the killer of kings. On the day of your death, we will drink and we'll sing. We're the children of Skyrim, and we fight all our lives. And when Sovngarde beckons, every one of us dies. But this land is ours, and we'll see it wiped clean of the scourge that has sullied. I don't know if that music is copyright or not. I hope not. <laughs> Are you working with them? You think you can take me? You so much as touch me and you're going to lose fingers. I mean it. I'll, I'll cut you in half. Sure. Shall the Alakir know where I am? What do they offer you? Gold? How many more of them are coming? Tell me. You can't tell them. Please, I need your help and there isn't anyone I can trust here in the city. I am not the person that the people of Whiterun think I am. My real name is Eamon. I am a noble of House Suda in Hammerfell. The men who are looking for me, the Alakir, they are assassins in the employ of the Almeri Dominion. They wish to exchange my blood for gold. I need you to root them out and drive them away before they find me and drag me back to Hammerfell for an execution. They're mercenaries, only in it for the money. They're led by a man named Kamatu. Get rid of him and the rest will scatter. I don't dare show my face, lest they recognize me. So you'll have to find out where they are. I heard one of them was just arrested trying to sneak into the city. If he's locked up in the jail, perhaps you can get it out of him. Please, I know I'm asking you to do something difficult, maybe even dangerous. I just don't know who else I can trust. Find me the moment the Alakir are taken care of. This game has a lot of missions. I, I, I... Ripe fruit and fresh veg. Really? You convinced that loot player to stop chasing me? I'd thank the gods, but I'll settle for thanking you. Here's some coin for your help. 250 coins. Just for telling someone to leave you alone. Let's steal. Finest cuts, fresh from the wilds. Those two at it again? Come on now. Watch the book good. Keep your balance. Hey, watch it! Somebody help! Stop, stop. Die, damn you! What are you waiting for? You think you stand a chance? Get him. Don't Kill know who I want to win. I'm gonna Get him, I'll guide me. Joy killing you. Someone do something. I'll see you burn. You're pathetic. Chance. 
I'm just a servant, dear. You want to talk to one of the companions, I'm sure. But I still hear the call of the blood. We all do. It is our burden to bear. But we can overcome. You have my brother and I, obviously. But I don't know if the rest will go along quite so easily. Leave that to me. A stranger comes to our home. Would you now? Here, let me have a look at you. Mm. Yes, perhaps. A certain strength of spirit. Master, you're not truly considering accepting him. I am nobody's master, Vilkas. And last I checked, we had some empty beds in Yorvaskar for those with a fire burning in their hearts. Apologies. But perhaps this isn't the time. I've never even heard of this outsider. Sometimes the famous come to us. Sometimes men and women come to us to seek their fame. It makes no difference. What matters is their heart. And their arm. Of course. How are you in battle, boy? That's the spirit. Vilkas here will get started on that. Vilkas, take him out to the yard and see what he can do. I... Is that... There's a... Day... Trap. I'm coming back for you. The reason I say I'm coming back is because after I've done a mission or two, it should let me uh, just ha have half the stuff in this building. And that Daedra heart is gonna be bloody oh, useful you. in the game. Endgame armor, Daedra armor. I probably won't end up even smithing it. I'd probably end up just finding it, but at the same time, I want to build it. But then dragon armor. It, see, it, it was on preface. I'd, I'd say Daedra armor is better, but I loved how dragon armor looks. The old man said to have a look at you. So, let's do this. Just have a few swings at me so I can see your form. Don't worry, I can take it. Pretty good arm you have there. Not bad. Next time won't be so easy. Yeah, it will. You might just make it. But for now, you're still a whelp to us, new blood. So you do what we tell you. Here's my sword. Go take it up to Yorland to have it sharpened. And be careful. It's probably worth more than you are. Fucking... what? What brings you here? I'm guessing you're the newcomer then. Oh, don't worry too much about it. They were all whelps once. They just might not like to talk about it. And don't always just do what you're told. Nobody rules anybody in the Companions. Well, I'm not sure how they've managed it, but they have. No leader since Yzgrimor. Kodlak is the Harbinger, and he's a sort of advisor for the whole group. But every man is his own. Every woman, her own. I have a favor to ask. I've been working on a shield for Aella. My wife is in mourning and I need to get back to her soon. I'd be much obliged if you could take this to Aella for me. That's a good man. Is 
the wall make the pretty face paint. Not you. Not you. I'd be dead if not for Vignor. He took me in and helped me turn my life around. I presume she's going to be downstairs. If you wish to hunt with me, your feet need to be quick and your eyes quicker. Isgrimor himself wouldn't have the patience to deal with all the rabble around here. Ah, good. I've been waiting for this. Good to see you made it up here. You know this one? I saw him training in the yard with Vilkis. Ah, yes. I heard you gave him quite a thrashing. Don't let Vilkis catch you saying that. Do you think you could handle Vilkis in a real fight? Ah, a man of action. Here, let's have Farkas show you where you'll be resting your head. Farkas. Did you call me? Of course we did, Ice Brain. Show this new blood where the rest of the whelps sleep. New blood? Oh, I remember you. Come on, follow me. All these younglings scampering around. Worried one of them is going to take your place? Your and Ayala like to tease me. Some but of them might people. try, but that's not what I'm worried about. They challenge us to be our best. But they might get themselves killed. Nice to have a new face around. It gets boring here sometimes. They should be so lucky. I hope we keep you. This can be a rough life. The quarters are up here. Just pick a bed and fall in it when you're tired. Tilma will keep the place clean. She always has. All right, so here you are. Looks like the others are eager to meet you. Come to me or Ayala if you're looking for work. Once you've made a bit of a name for yourself, Skior and Vilkas might have things for you to do. Good luck. Welcome to the Companions. By the way, if you're looking for something to do, we've gotten a letter about someone needing some muscle right here in Whiterun Hold. I don't know what the fight is about, and that's not our business anyway. I just need you to go out there, look tough, and scare this milk drinker into submission. No more than that. I don't want to hear about a killing, understand? Go. Bring honor to yourself, and the companions. By the way, if you're looking for something to do... I'm still trying to figure out why Skior let you in in the first place. Because I'm the best. Skior says that I... Some people don't think I'm smart. Those people get my fist. But you, I like. seen the company of the companions that's an honorable path you're on friend well I hope you enjoyed this episode this episode's going to be a bit longer than a few episodes before you might not want to sit through it all in one go it's um but yeah uh 
next uh, next episode will be continuing with the main quest I will get to the burrow so you don't have to watch the uh, walking um, and yeah if you're enjoying this series make sure you subscribe and uh, keep up to date with it there should be at least two to three episodes a week so I hope you're enjoying and I'll see you all in the next video see ya